Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys today. We are on my favorite account right now, my Town Hall 8. And our defense is doing pretty well, guys. So we're going to go ahead. I'm going to show you guys a couple of defensive replays right here of the base. Uh, just doing what I designed it to do, and that is protect my town hall. Now, um, after watching these, there's a couple things that I think I might end up tweaking, but we're going to go ahead and uh, just review these and see what happens. So you can see this guy has level 6 barge um, attacking me, which is pretty good. So he's coming in for my elixir. He's already got 92,000 of it, and he wants the rest of it, which I am completely fine with because I have no more elixir upgrades right now. All that I can use my elixir for, guys, is for troops. And so that's why I randomly do P.E.K.K.A. raids. We'll probably do a P.E.K.K.A. raid after this. I've got some P.E.K.K.A.s trained up. Um, I've got P.E.K.K.A.s, dragons, all this kind of stuff that I train up when I'm going to be away for a little bit. But otherwise, I just use Barch and uh, throw in some giants and whatnot. But you can see this guy coming in, stealing my elixir, which I'm totally fine with. And he's not done, though. He's like, all right. I think I'm going to try and get the 50% on this, or he's going to head up in here towards that Dark Elixir, which I don't want him to get to because I need my Dark Elixir to upgrade my troops. And I have 1,300 available, so uh, he does have a level 8 king and a level 9 queen, which are definitely going to do work on my base. Um, my king is a higher level than his, which is kind of funny, but uh, it's, it's at the bottom, so it's... I'm, I'm not even in competition with him when it comes to heroes right now. So he's dropping off a heal spell, keeping his heroes up, and they're just going to head straight in. I almost feel like I should remove that wall, that one corner wall up there that they just hit, because then they would have uh, walked over towards that gold mine, which would have been preferable, obviously. Um, so it would have kept them away from the middle. So I might actually do that, um, but we'll go ahead and see in a little bit. So he does have his queen on my Dark Elixir right there. Goes ahead and uses her ability, guys, and he takes it all. He takes 1,300 Dark Elixir, which I needed. I needed that Dark Elixir, so now I'm pretty upset with Exogs You. Is that how you say your name? Your name? Clans Chim Geo. But we go ahead and take out his queen right there as she's working on our town hall. Can't touch this town hall. 48%, guys. That's clutch. That is a clutch defense right there for Gaming with Mole. I don't know who that guy is, but he just defended pretty well. <laughs> but we're going to go ahead and review another one. I'm going to head back in here. You can see that we did lose one right there um, and uh, got 67% on that. But we're looking at the ones that we won because that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to win. I'm trying to defend my base. So this guy has level 5 Barch, uh, but he's actually doing BAM. He's got some minions up in here that he's going to be attacking with. And he's got a level 3 Queen. Looks like his King was probably uh, down. So his king's probably just upgrading or resting right now. But again, 270,000 elixir available. Anybody that finds me is going to get a lot of elixir, which again, I'm totally fine with because I don't need it at this point. Um... I don't need it. I don't need my elixir that much until I max out. So maybe once we get up to the point where all of our gold uh, upgrades are done, then we'll go ahead and start trying to protect that so we can research once we hit Town Hall 9. Uh, but as you can see, guys, the defense is doing pretty well, and that's what we wanted to do because we are pushing. I don't know how far we're going to push. I've never pushed at Town Hall 8 like this. Um, we're going to max out every single thing on this base before we upgrade it, and then even then we're probably going to push with like Town Hall 8. Go wipe, all that kind of stuff. So in in preparation for that guys why don't y'all tell me what y'all want to see as a max town hall 8 because i don't think there are that many max town hall 8 videos out there and i want to be able to provide you guys with stuff that y'all haven't seen so let me know what you want to see if you are a town hall 8 or a town hall 7 fix and go to town hall 8 let me know what y'all want to see from this account as we move it up once again you can see we defended very well there that guy did not get to our dark elixir nope he only got 20 of it from one of our drills uh, which I'm perfectly fine with. I'm totally fine with him snagging 20 Dark Elixir if that's what he wants. But another close, close call right there, guys, at 48%. So uh, what I need to do is move in some of those storages so that barbarians can't get them as easily. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to go up here. Um, what should we do? I think we're going to go up here towards the top of the base, yeah, and we're going to snag these walls right here, but we have to go into the village edit mode, so we're going to snag these walls, we're going to take away those two and these two right here, and we're going to bring in two buildings, that's going to save us a little bit of percentage that barbarians would be getting, um, <clears throat> so now only archers can get it, 
which uh, I would rather have happen because now it'll take them a little bit longer to get the percentages that they are looking for. So now we got to find a place for these walls. Uh, we could put them there. No, I'm going to move these skeleton traps in, though, so that as troops come in towards that wizard tower, guys, they're going to get distracted by the skeletons, and my wizard tower is going to focus them down and crush them as they're messing around with the skeleton traps. That's going to be awesome. So we could put the walls here. Um... But I don't really think that's going to help us that much. That's definitely not going to help us that much. So we're going to go ahead and remove those. Um, and maybe we can put them out towards these cannons on the side. Yeah, let's put them over here. So we're going to put two right there. And we're going to scoot this barrack out. We're going to go ahead and put these other ones right here. We're going to move this wall in. And we're going to put three in front. And then we're going to go move this wall over here as well. And then we're going to go raid with all these P.E.K.K.A.s. So we're going to put that in place. There we go and uh, save changes, head on back home. And I think that that might protect those cannons just a little bit more. But why don't we go ahead and attack, guys? We're gonna grab these P.E.K.K.A.s and we're gonna send them out uh, on duty and I'll be back with a raid right now. Look at that. Look at that loot, guys. 547,000 loot. But that's a perfect base to barge. I don't know how our P.E.K.K.A.s are gonna do on it because uh, they're slow and they have to travel around a lot. So we're going to go ahead and just spread them out, kind of let them collect up here towards the top because there are a bunch of uh, mines and pumps up there. So that should work out pretty well for us as they start moving in. You can see we broke the wall right there. So we're going to get three P.E.K.K.A.s inside right here. We're going to drop down that rage spell on them and uh, get them raged up and up in here going to town. We are trying to get trophies again, guys, as I was saying, because we are pushing. We've already gotten a good amount of the loot, but there is still some for us to steal. You can see there's an altercation over here between this P.E.K.K.A. and this king, but I'm going to send in my level 10 king, and we're going to say, get out of here. Take him out. Go ahead and take out this gold mine for us as well and get that down to only 13,000 gold left. So we definitely got a good percentage of the gold so far. And our P.E.K.K.A.s are moving in. Now they are moving in towards their enemy, which is the Tesla. Even level 1 Teslas can do a lot of damage to P.E.K.K.A.s behind walls. So you have to be careful. It's going to get really close up here in the middle. As you can see, we got two Teslas working on them. But we're going to go ahead and take that down. Get that two star. Yeah, buddy. And keep on working through the base. There is 12,000 gold left. Um, but it's going to be in these storages that we're about to get with our king. And I'm pretty sure this P.E.K.K.A. that's working on this elixir drill is going to head over to that other gold storage. Yep, there she goes. So she's going to head over, take out the rest of that gold for us right there. Come on, do it. Take it out. One more hit. One more hit, P.E.K.K.A. Come on. There we go. So we got all the loot that we wanted, guys. And uh, that looks like it. That looks like we're going to wrap this up. We're going to go ahead and end as this P.E.K.K.A. decides to beat up on this wall right here. But we got a good amount of uh, Dark Elixir. <clears throat> 300 is not too bad. But total, guys, we have 23,000, almost 24,000 Dark Elixir. So you guys know what that means. Yep, that's right. We can actually upgrade uh, some more troops. We're going to go ahead and train up some archers to go with all these P.E.K.K.A.s that I have training up. We are about to... Um, nope. We will have already streamed by the time this is up, but guys, we do stream our Town Hall 8 on twitch.tv forward slash gaming with Molt, so make sure you go head over there and follow so you can get a notification whenever I am streaming, but as you can see right in here, guys, we are going to be upgrading our Hog Riders next for sure, and that's going to be it for this episode. I hope that you guys enjoyed, and as always, leave a like on the video, make sure you keep calm and clash on for me, right? I'll see you guys later. Peace.